This is beyond a dream and beyond a goal. Basically the mentality has been fun first, right? And then competition second. And overarchingly in this race, fun wins overall. I mean, my heart's been racing from start to finish and it still is and I'm not sure if it'll stop. I mean, that first wave coming out of the Solent, we were just pounding into the waves nonstop. We have prepared for this. So regardless of the conditions, we knew what we were signed up for and it brought out the best in everyone and it brought us closer together as a team and it paid off in the end for us. So Bobo 65 wants heavy weather and big weather and fast and it was unbelievable and we are stacked to be second place. Crazy. Jao coming in on Starball, tacking right on the line. You wouldn't want to be any closer than that. They were meters back. And as soon as you see the breeze in, if you're sailing on those boats, you know you're going to be in for a good ride. And we went for it, and we came out of the Solent hard and heavy. This was a fire hose, just coming at you, but we were flying. There's something that happens when you are off watch, you come up on watch, and all of a sudden you see the rock probably like 20 meters away from you. It's impressive. And then the second thing is the people. You can't beat the people. That's what makes a boat like that. That's what makes a race. That's what makes it fun. And that's what we're here for. We're here to be together. And that is the defining moment. To be surrounded by our mentors and these sailors that I've looked up to and who've been with dad forever. And it was an experience of a lifetime. It was the perfect boat for the perfect weather, for the perfect fast net. And it was unbelievable. And we're so lucky to have experienced it the as a family crew. together. If you do fast net and you have a good time, there's nothing better. That's why you do the race.